Chronic fatigue syndrome, also known as CFS, is a complex and debilitating condition that affects millions of people worldwide. This condition is characterized by extreme fatigue that does not improve with rest and is not caused by any underlying medical conditions. Individuals with CFS often experience a profound lack of energy, which can greatly impact their ability to carry out daily activities and lead a fulfilling life. While the exact cause of CFS remains unknown, researchers believe that a combination of genetic, environmental, and psychological factors may play a role in its development. It is important to note that CFS is not simply a case of feeling tired or lazy. It is a genuine medical condition that can significantly affect a person's physical and mental well-being. We are grateful for your viewership of our movie. If you enjoyed it, we would be honored if you could consider subscribing to our channel. Your support enables us to produce more captivating movies for your enjoyment. Additionally, taking a moment to leave a comment would mean a lot to us. We sincerely thank you in advance for your support and feedback. Symptoms of Chronic Fatigue Syndrome The symptoms of CFS can vary from person to person, but the primary symptom is persistent and overwhelming fatigue. This fatigue is not relieved by rest or sleep and can worsen with physical or mental exertion. Other common symptoms include Muscle and joint pain. Many individuals with CFS experience widespread pain in their muscles and joints, which can be severe and debilitating. Cognitive difficulties. CFS can cause difficulties with memory, concentration, and thinking, often referred to as brain fog. Sleep disturbances. Individuals with CFS may have trouble falling asleep, staying asleep, or experience unrefreshing sleep. Headaches, frequent headaches, including migraines, are a common symptom of CFS. Sensitivity to light and sound. Many individuals with CFS are sensitive to bright lights, loud noises, and other sensory stimuli. Diagnosing chronic fatigue syndrome. Diagnosing CFS can be challenging as there are no specific tests or markers for the condition. Instead, healthcare professionals rely on a thorough evaluation of the patient's symptoms and medical history to make a diagnosis. The process typically involves ruling out other potential causes of the symptoms, such as thyroid disorders, autoimmune diseases, and sleep disorders. In 2015, the Institute of Medicine, now the National Academy of Medicine, released new diagnostic criteria for CFS, which are widely accepted by healthcare professionals. These criteria require the presence of persistent fatigue for at least six months, along with the presence of other symptoms such as cognitive difficulties and post-exertional malaise. The Impact of Chronic Fatigue Syndrome on Daily Life Living with chronic fatigue syndrome can have a profound impact on every aspect of a person's life. The constant fatigue and other symptoms can make it challenging to perform even the simplest of tasks, such as getting out of bed, taking a shower, or preparing a meal. Many individuals with CFS find it difficult to maintain employment or participate in social activities, leading to feelings of isolation and frustration. The unpredictable nature of CFS can also be incredibly frustrating. One day, a person may feel relatively well and able to engage in activities, while the next day they may be completely bedridden. This unpredictability can make it difficult to plan and commit to obligations, causing strain in personal and professional relationships. Coping Strategies for Living with Chronic Fatigue Syndrome While there is currently no cure for CFS, there are several coping strategies that individuals can utilize to manage their symptoms and improve their quality of life. Here are some effective strategies. Pacing. Learning to pace oneself is crucial for individuals with CFS. This involves balancing activity and rest to avoid overexertion and minimize symptom flare-ups. Stress management. Stress can exacerbate symptoms of CFS, so it is important to develop effective stress management techniques, such as mindfulness meditation, deep breathing exercises, and relaxation techniques. Sleep hygiene, establishing a regular sleep routine, and creating a sleep-friendly environment can help improve the quality of sleep for individuals with CFS. Diet and nutrition. Eating a balanced diet and avoiding foods that may trigger inflammation or worsen symptoms can play a significant role in managing CFS symptoms. 
Support system, building a strong support system of family, friends, and healthcare professionals, can provide emotional support and practical assistance when needed. Treatment options for chronic fatigue syndrome. While there is no specific medication to treat CFS, healthcare professionals may recommend a combination of treatments to manage symptoms and improve overall well being. Some common treatment options include medications. Certain medications, such as pain relievers, antidepressants, and sleep aids, may be prescribed to alleviate specific symptoms associated with CFS. Cognitive Behavioral Therapy, CBT. CBT is a type of therapy that helps individuals change negative thoughts and behaviors, develop coping strategies, and manage stress. Graded Exercise Therapy, GET. GET involves gradually increasing physical activity levels in a structured and supervised manner to improve physical function and reduce symptoms. Alternative therapies. Some individuals with CFS find relief from symptoms through alternative therapies such as acupuncture, massage therapy, and herbal supplements. However, it is important to discuss these options with a healthcare professional before trying them. Research and advancements in understanding chronic fatigue syndrome. Although there is still much to learn about CFS, researchers and scientists are actively working to better understand the condition and develop more effective treatments. Recent advancements in the field include genetic research. Scientists are studying the genetic factors that may contribute to the development of CFS, which may lead to targeted treatments in the future. Immunological studies. Research is being conducted to explore the role of the immune system in CFS with the aim of identifying potential biomarkers and therapeutic targets. Neurological investigations. Studies are underway to investigate the neurological basis of CFS, including abnormalities in brain structure and function. Treatment trials. Clinical trials are being conducted to evaluate the effectiveness of various treatment approaches, including new medications and therapies. Support groups and resources for individuals with chronic fatigue syndrome. Living with CFS can be challenging, but there are numerous support groups and resources available for individuals seeking assistance and connection. These include online support communities. Online forums and social media groups provide a platform for individuals with CFS to connect, share experiences, and seek advice. Patient advocacy organizations. Organizations such as the Chronic Fatigue Syndrome Association and the Solve ME CFS Initiative offer resources, educational materials, and support for individuals with CFS. Supportive healthcare professionals. Finding a healthcare professional who is knowledgeable about CFS and supportive of your needs can make a significant difference in managing the condition. Therapy and counseling. Engaging in individual or group therapy can provide emotional support and help individuals develop coping strategies for living with CFS. Chronic fatigue syndrome, myths and misconceptions. Despite the growing awareness of CFS, there are still many myths and misconceptions surrounding the condition. Some common misconceptions include, CFS is not a real illness. CFS is a legitimate medical condition that has been recognized by major medical organizations, including the World Health Organization and the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. CFS is caused by laziness or a lack of motivation. CFS is a complex condition with multifactorial causes, and it is not caused by laziness or a lack of motivation. Exercise can cure CFS. While exercise can be beneficial for some individuals with CFS, it is not a cure and should be approached with caution. CFS only affects women. While CFS is more common in women, it can affect individuals of any gender, age, or background. Conclusion. Chronic fatigue syndrome is a challenging and complex condition that significantly impacts the lives of those affected. It is crucial to raise awareness, debunk myths, and provide support for individuals with CFS. By understanding the symptoms, diagnosis process, coping strategies, treatment options, and available resources, we can work towards a better future for those living with chronic fatigue syndrome.
Remember, CFS is a real medical condition and those affected deserve our empathy, understanding and support. We are grateful for your viewership of our movie. If you enjoyed it, we would be honored if you could consider subscribing to our channel. Your support enables us to produce more captivating movies for your enjoyment. Additionally, taking a moment to leave a comment would mean a lot to us. We sincerely thank you in advance for your support and feedback.